And next for New York, Everson Pereira. And that one almost got him. Cut on and missed 96 of that fastball. It might be time to choke up a little bit. Get that front foot to first, and he breaks for second. And he's out at first. He can't get back. This just can't happen right here. I mean, your run really doesn't mean anything unless it's followed by another run and you're able to tie up the ball game. But you've almost got to stay anchored to first base to prevent something like this from happening. And a seed into center. That's a base hit. Well, the last 10 games or so have been anything but fun at the plate for him, so that one has to feel good. Just a cookie down the middle. I mean, those are the ones you dream about. The ones in the cage, you're just hoping you get in the ball game. Right down the middle, not a whole lot of velocity, right on top of it. Wells, the batter now as he swings and misses for strike one. The next pitch misses, and it's one and one. No, he's really working him away this at bat. Sometimes take a little bit off velocity. Try to get a rollover, something on the ground. Stay away from that big hole on the right side of the infield. Pereira off of first with two away. Looking very settled on the mound here in the eighth. One more out, and they'll probably hand it off to their closer for the ninth with at least a two-run lead. Next offering is down low. Little trouble with this one behind the plate. Zanino up with it to first. That completes the strikeout inning over. We're back. It's the top of the ninth. And there's a new pitcher on the mound, Michael King. He's pitching on two days rest. And first offering is fouled off. King, a 6-3 righty. He features a sinker, a slider, a four-seamer, and he works in a changeup. Just a really nice slider down and in there. He wants to get the hitter thinking fastball, speed him up, and just subtract some velocity and add a little movement. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And there's one away. So in now for Cleveland, George Valera. And that's in there for strike one. That one missed. One and one. Next pitch in for a strike. One and two. The punch out there. That's the second out. Well, Boog, I'll tell you, when he goes to look at the video of that pitch, he's going to want to punch himself. That slider had hit me ridden all over it, and clearly he just got a little too excited and was out in front. Tell you what, when you get a pitch like that, you cannot miss it. Those have a chance to go a long way. Swing and a high fly ball in the air left field. Back there, and it's gone. His first homer in the majors, and they're going to have to send somebody to get that ball for him. Always such a special moment. You know this is one of the biggest thrills of his life. He's got to be floating around the bases right now. Yeah, he'll remember every detail of that at bat for years, as he should. It's a true once-in-a-lifetime event. Now, Boog, there's so many times when a young player might wonder if he's ever even going to get to the big leagues and do something like this. Well, he doesn't have to wonder anymore. And now number 33. Oh, and he swings and misses at the initial offering. That one down the line. And it goes just foul. And he deals. Got him looking. Fastball at the letters. Frozen for strike three. Solo shot for the Guardians this inning. It's 5-2. Here comes Emmanuel Classe out of the bullpen. 
And I can't imagine any save is an easy one. You're holding a small lead on the scoreboard, and you know those hitters are going to give you the best at bats they can. So it's always high stress. Let's see what he's got here to try and close it out. LeMayhew now at the plate as he swings through strike one. Just not able to catch up to that velocity. Next offering is in for a strike. Cuts and misses. It's a strikeout. And up next for New York, Anthony Volpe. Fouled off left side. The pitch. That misses off the outside edge. Popped up. Makes the catch for the out. The right fielder, number 99, Aaron Judge. So they're down to their final out. And now big number 99, Aaron Judge. Outfield playing very deep, not wanting anything over their heads. And Judge spoils that one. Deal one. And a foul ball. There comes an 0-2 to judge. Line drive. And that'll do it. The Guardians add another to their winning streak. So they break into another level with this win streak at 10 now. I think the key is to maintain the focus because you can have this motivation to get to double digits and then have a letdown. They've got to try to just put out all the distractions, turn off the sports highlights, and come back out here and play baseball the way they've been doing it in the next game. And your final score, 5-2. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Chambi saying so long. Thank mm -hmm. you.